Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Guys, in today's video, I am going to show you how to install Oracle SQL Developer. Also, I will be showing you how to connect it to your database. So guys, let's start the video. Oracle SQL Developer is a GUI tool where you can write your Oracle queries, SQL queries you can write over there. So first of all guys, you can open any of your favorite browser and here you can search for Oracle SQL Developer. So guys, you can see this search here, we have oracle.com website, just click on this SQL Developer downloads link. So it will redirect you to this website and guys here you can see it's showing me uh, SQL Developer version. So here you need to just scroll down and depending on your platform you have to download. So I am having Windows 64 bit machine so I will be downloading this. So here you have to accept the license and just click on this download SQL developer button. So it will ask you for login. So you should have Oracle account. Just login with your Oracle account. So guys. So guys now it has redirected me to this sign in page if you don't have oracle account then you can create and sign in i'm already having account so i just entered my uh, login detail and i'm clicking on this sign in button so guys now it has logged in successfully and you can see now my download has been started okay so guys my download is done now it is a zip file so i need to extract it so i'm just going to this download location and here i'm extracting this zip file so now guys after extraction here you can see inside this folder i'm having sql developer folder and inside that i'm having this application so you have to just start this sql developer application so whenever you want to start sql developer you need to go to this uh, folder and you need to start or you can create shortcut on your desktop so done guys now here it's showing me this message uh, it is uh, showing that whether you want your preferences or not so i'm going to click on no button okay guys so now here i'm going to click on ok button so my developer is started now now we have to make connection with our databases so we have already installed oracle now uh, we have to connect with that oracle so here left side you can see this option databases just right click and click on create new connection option now here guys it will ask you name so provide a suitable name so i'm giving name as oracle 21c and below guys it is asking me some other details so we have to provide the details so uh, username and password so whatever username and password you have given during installation time you have to provide that you have forgotten username and password then what you can do you can um, uh, alter your password also so here is the command for altering your password so what you can do you can first open a command prompt and then uh, there you can uh, write sql plus space slash as this dba and then you can write this alter command alter user system identity Identified by this is a new password so you can provide a new password to this system user and then um, a password is changed now in one more query you required select name from v dollar database so this is going to give you name so it could be orcl or it could be xc in my case i'm using xc i have entered my password and i have i have taken care of my databases so orcl or xc and these are the certain and other information which you require so just click on this connect button and guys you can see my connection has been established successfully here left side you can see uh, what i'm getting i'm getting already available databases so guys here you can see in my database i'm having various built-in table as well as i'm having one table which i created previously so now i'm just opening this table you can see column in this table uh, now if you want to uh, create a query or you want to uh, write query so you can write over here in this query column so whatever query you want to run you can run so you can create database table everything you can do so simply guys here I'm uh, writing a command create table and then I'm giving name to my table and then provide column to your table so I'm creating employee table and employee number and employee name is going to be column to my employee table 
सो गाइज माई क्वेरी इज कम्प्लीटेड नाउ आई विल बी रनिंग दिस क्वेरी सो जस्ट सेलेक्ट दिस ग्रीन कलर प्ले बटन सो यू कैन सी आई एम गेटिंग मैसेज हियर एंड इफ यू गो टू डेटा बेसिस इफ यू रिफ्रेश योर डेटा बेस यू कैन सी एम्प्लॉय टेबल इज क्रिएटेड देर ऑल्सो सो हियर आई एम जस्ट रिफ्रेशिंग माई डेटा बेस बाय राइट क्लिकिंग एंड देन हियर गाइज यू कैन सी नाउ इट्स शोइंग मी माई एम्प्लॉय डेटा बेस हियर यू कैन सी द कॉलम्स नाउ अगेन आई विल राइट वन क्वेरी डिस्क्राइब क्वेरी so then uh, describe and then my table name okay so guys you can see it's showing me my columns of a table so you can type any commands over here right so guys i hope uh, by following my video you are able to successfully uh, install sql developer as well as you are able to use it so guys if really my video has helped you then don't forget to hit on like button and if you have any kind of query do feel free to ask in comment box i will surely reply to your queries and guys uh, please share my videos my channel to your friends it is going to help me and guys if you are new to my channel please subscribe to my channel and don't forget to hit bell icon to receive updates from my channel also guys i'm there on various social media all my social media link i have given in description box you can follow me there i'm sharing lots of notes and pdf on my telegram channel certainly you can join my telegram channel and you can access all that pdf so i conclude my video guys thank you for watching my video i'll see you in my next video till that bye bye and take care guys